is officially December and you know what that means. We need to decorate the room and we need to get into the holiday vibes. A little bit behind already just because it is already December but I'm very excited. I love December and I love Christmas in general. I think it's also because my birthday is in December so it's very celebratory and fun and a festive time. We might get our Christmas tree today or tomorrow so that will be really fun to decorate as well. I decided not to buy kind of anything new for my room this year just because I already have things. It's really expensive to buy new decorations and I have nowhere to store them anyways so we're gonna work with what we got. So I've laid out some of the stuff that I already have. I also need to burn um, the advent candle and I'm a couple days behind so we gotta do that. I have cute little trees and this tree so let's see where we can put some things as well. Let's do the bed first. I'm gonna switch out this blanket for this red one that I have because it is way more festive. Also, can we just ignore my work from home setup? I'm working from home now and I don't like my setup right now. It's not very aesthetic at all and I'm kind of sad about it. I'm also sad because in the past I've actually gotten rid of this desk during the holiday season and I've actually gotten a Christmas tree for my room a couple times and obviously I can't do that this year because I have to work. I know I don't need a tree in my room and I've already done it before and it was always a dream of mine so we don't need to do it again but it did bring me a lot of joy and it was really nice in the nighttime when I put on the lights it was just cozy in bed it really set the vibes nice but yeah trees are too expensive now and I have to work unfortunately so we can't do that. Even. Okay, I usually put this tinsel up above my bed and for some reason I think it's because I changed my bed this year It's completely off-center. It is completely uneven because I have the three M hooks there that I have had for a really long time And I don't really want to put like another one up beside it or take them down Okay guys, I fixed it. Everything is fine now. I'm really glad except for as long as this pin doesn't like fly out and hit me at night We're good it is also time to pull out all of the Bath and Body Works candles. I have Fresh Balsam. Fresh Balsam is my favorite. I actually got two more Fresh Balsams. I got these I think a couple months ago or something, maybe during summer, and I believe they were only like two dollars or something from Bath and Body Works. They were giving them away for really cheap because of the season, I guess. So I'm stocked up with those. Then I also have the winter one from Bath and Body Works, and I like the smell of this too. It's very, very Christmassy. It's a few days later, and we're gonna decorate the tree now. Exciting! Very first Where ornament. Where should I go? Oh. tickets that I got for my birthday. I scratched two of them already and I won nothing. So let's hope these two have something. There's nothing. No luck. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, hi guys. It is a couple days later, but as you saw, I was decorating my room and we also started decorating our Christmas tree, but we kind of hit a wall because it's easier to see during the daytime and we were doing it at night. So we might add more to that. We need to add the tinsel and stuff, but that was super cute and festive. And I also wanted to show updates with my room because one, the lighting's better now, and two, I've gotten some new things. Okay, look at how cute this is. My boyfriend got me this baby tree as part of my birthday present because I was talking about how I was kind of sad I couldn't get a tree for my room this year. But I got this baby one and it's so adorable. I love it. And I put a couple of decorations on. I might add some more, but it's so cute. And it's just sitting on my dresser so it's kind of a nice way to add a little a little fun to your room it also smells really good too even though it's not like the typical christmas tree it has a really good scent okay i'm gonna start wrapping some gifts because i'm a little bit behind with everything i haven't finished my shopping but i'm gonna start wrapping anyways 
These are the papers we're going with. I think I'll use this one for my boyfriend and then maybe go with this theme for the other ones. Also, look at my cute little Christmas socks. Ooh. Right, I'm gonna start with this because it's easiest. It's the Lego that I'm giving my boyfriend. And I like how it's already in a perfect box, so I don't need I don't need to do anything crazy. Oh. I love wrapping presents, honestly. It's kind of fun. And I know some people hate it, but I don't know. It's kind of satisfying. I feel like you can definitely tell what this is because it's making so much sound. So I didn't really think about that. It's kind of obvious. I've been talking to Santa and he told me everything that you want this year. I went shopping and planning ribbons and candles. I got it all right here. I kind of need to spruce them up a bit, but at least we got presents. For some reason, I feel like I'm not fully in the Christmas spirit and vibes yet. I feel like I need to either make my gingerbread house, make some cookies, see some lights or something and get more in the spirit. I'm gonna go shopping today and hopefully kind of finish off the Christmas shopping. But yeah, that's the situation right now. I also feel like it's just the weather too. Like it hasn't snowed, so it's not magical yet. We need it to be magical. Okay, hi guys. It is the next day. I'm currently getting ready for high tea. I'm going with my mom and my sister and it is a festive themed one. So that's gonna be really fun. Um, but I just wanted to do a little quick chit chat, kind of get ready with me. I do have only like 20, 30 minutes to get ready. So a little bit rushed, but we're gonna do it anyways. I've just been wanting to kind of sit down and talk and touch base because maybe you have noticed, maybe you have not, but I've been kind of MIA and I don't feel good about it. I feel like in the summer I was having so much fun. I was creating videos and I had lots of time to do that. And I had lots of time to make them something I'm very proud of and have the finished product be something that I think is worthy enough to go online. I feel bad because like I want to be filming but also when I do film I'm like okay that's not good enough I'm not very proud of it and I don't want to put it on so I'm gonna hope to post this video still and I'm thinking like I should just chill with it and post whatever I like not worry about if it's good enough because I feel like in the end this the main goal of this is kind of documenting my life and remembering what it was like at a certain time in my life um so I'm gonna try and just post like for instance i also have a video that i haven't finished editing that was from aix en provence when i went this summer so like in august um so i posted something from when i went to the south of france with my friend but i also went on my own for like a week or a little less and so i have footage from that but i just haven't posted it and now it also feels too late to post that i'm thinking because Obviously, it's almost the next year. Summer is completely over, but at the same time, it was such a good experience and a great memory. So I'm like, I wanna post it. I haven't finished it, I don't know. I feel like in the new year, I want to set clearer goals for that so I can stay on track better and um, maybe just make a better schedule so that I don't feel like I'm flailing and I get to do what I want to do. But yeah, that's kind of how I'm feeling right now and kind of just what I wanted to talk about. Um, yeah, like even this vlog's been kind of scattered all over the place. And I'm trying to get in the festive vibes, but honestly, Christmas is coming so soon and I'm scared. I'm really scared. I need to still shop, I need to do all the things, and that's stressful. I think that I'm going to film a video, kind of like a year in review video of just how my year's been and how I've grown and kind of what I'm looking forward to next year. I think that'll be good. Other updates is the working out has completely fallen off. I haven't worked out in a while. Um, at least like a home workout and doing like something intentionally um, and I feel like that's just because I've been busy so I think in the new year I need to start setting better routines and be more intentional about that so that I actually have time to do everything okay so I think at this point I'm just gonna finish getting ready and then maybe show my outfit and then go because I'm running out of time and I want to make sure I look kind of cute because I want some photos, um, so let's finish getting ready. Mm -hmm. 